Hey everybody, Chad with Nobody Else's Auto. Got some more super cool new inventory to check out tonight. Just picked up this little 1962 Chevy Nova Tudor hardtop or Chevy 2. Didn't have any of these in stock at all. These little early Novas are really tough to find. They've been popular for years. A lot of people like them. And I had nothing in stock for these early 60s Novas. This car is pretty rough. There's not a ton left of it. But like I said, I didn't have any of them. And this car is a Tudor hardtop. So we went ahead and hauled it in. Let's check it out, see what it looks like. Even though it is rough, we'll still take a look at it. Well, here she is, 1962 Chevy 2 Nova 400 two-door hardtop. And it's rough. Like I told you, this car has been sitting for years. It is rusty, it is beat, it is not complete. But it is a two-door hardtop, and I didn't have any of them in stock, so we went ahead and bought it and brought it on in. When I said rough, it's rough. It is rusty everywhere. Even around the back window and the roof, it's rusty. But there's still a lot of trim there. The back window's there. All the window moldings are there. Around the back, the bumper's there, but it's twisted up. But the trim's there. The trunk ornament's still there. But a lot of the sheet metal on this little car is pretty tough. But like I said, it is a two-door hardtop. It does have some of this trim on it, all the two-door type stuff. Some of the side moldings are still workable. Inside, some of the dash stuff is still here. an extra door laying in there that I threw in there. That was one I have found on another car a while back. So I try to keep the light type parts in those type of cars so I know where they're at in case somebody needs one. Coming around the front of this, obviously the hood hinges are definitely sprung and the front's pretty banged up as well on this little Nova. Under the hood, no motor, no tranny. So she's been pretty much stripped bare few bits and pieces left under here but not a heck of a lot does still have the washer bottle bracket though <laughs> trim tag is still here showing a 62 and we'll work our way over here on the passenger side of the car there again being a two-door hardtop it does have some of this trim around the roof line things like that the right door doesn't look too bad. The right fender is probably fixable. A little bit of sheet metal left on this car, but very little. Take a peek inside here from the passenger side. And like I said, not a heck of a lot left in here, just bits and pieces. Other than that two door sedan door that I just threw in there, but seats are gone. Few pieces of trim here and there left on this little Nova, but just not a heck of a lot. Somebody customized the antenna on it at one point in his life. But there she is, 1962 Chevy 2 Nova Tudor hardtop. The only one I've got, so. Still bits and pieces left there, but she's definitely a little tough around the edges. Well, there she is. Like I told you, she's definitely a little tough around the edges, but I had nothing. No 62s, 3s, 4s, nothing in those early Novas. So when I had the chance to pick up this car, even though there wasn't a lot left of it, there were still bits and pieces. It was affordable enough where I could justify bringing it in, putting it in inventory, and uh, sitting on it till we find, till some guys need some bits and pieces off of it. So when I find cars that I don't have anything here on, I always like to add them to inventory, fill those holes. You never know what somebody's gonna need. And if I don't have the inventory here, you don't have a chance to sell it and help somebody out with their project. So hope you guys liked it. If you got any questions about the little Nova or any of the other close to 2000 cars and trucks we've got here in stock in nobody else's auto, just give me a call. We've got a pretty diverse inventory, a lot of stuff in here with close to 2,000 cars and trucks on the ground. So just give me a shout if you've got any questions. 620-786-4428, that's my number. That's the best way to catch me. So we can have that short conversation about your project, year, make, model, body style, the parts you need, or what you're looking for for a project, the specifics of what you want. That's the information that I need to know if I may or may not have something here to help you out. So give me a shout. We can have that short conversation. You like old cars, you like old trucks, you like memorabilia, be sure to check out the channel, Nobody's Show. That's all we talk about on here because that's pretty much all I know about. So 
But uh, we have a lot of fun on here. We like old iron. Well, that's what we do on here. So check out the channel. Be sure to click that subscribe button. Definitely click that notification button because we do do some cool live stuff on here as well that you don't want to miss. So thanks for watching, everybody. Stay tuned. We've got a lot more cool inventory that's been coming in lately. I've been buying a lot of cars and trucks. We're going to keep showing it to you. Thanks for hanging out with us. Hope you enjoyed this one. Stay tuned for the next one.